Hello everyone, it's Irina and I'm showing you my DT project for this week for Wild Orchid Craft. And um, I, a uh, long time ago I wanted to do air balloon but I had no chance, kind of like I had no uh, real project going on for that but um, this week I decided to play around with muffin tins, like with, tin, with uh, gel tins and um, this is what I came with my project today. Let me show you very quick uh, what I was using. So all that the colors that I'm going to use, I was using this time with um, vintage color and I tried to do a little bit uh, vintage uh, look in my um, hot air balloon. So I was using that uh, mixed color, vintage color, uh, open roses set, 25, 20 and uh, 15, and 15 millimeters and I was using um, aqua, beige and pink uh, color, no actually beige, pink and white colors here. So this is vintage. Uh, and then also I was using, um, I really like this set, it's actually pastel tone rose buds, 4 millimeters, so I like that because you can choose any kind of colors, like kind of like pinkish, purplish and white and it's few different um, colors and choices in, in this set. So I was choosing that. Um, also I was using rose buds, white, and I was I had uh, from previous order, I didn't have it left over, and I had uh, rose buds, uh, kind of like vintage looking uh, color, uh, you will see in my project, so I will, I will put link below to that uh, product also. And uh, of course, um, this time I was using that uh, silver um, pearl stems, and um, I really like to use stems in my project, so it gives me good look. So this is stems, and I was using the um, beautiful uh, crown pin uh, stick pins, which came in a uh, packet package. Uh, I think I don't remember how many it was here, but I already used a few of them. And I like that uh, stick pins here. And uh, small white uh, rhinestone flowers and diamonds. Yeah, so this is my uh, project. What I was playing this um, week. So, what I was doing here, this is um, uh, kind of like a cake tin, and it's tin. So you can um, cook a little little cake here. So I picked that tin, and um, the second tin I was using um, heart shape cake. Uh, so what I did, I air spray a couple of layers here um, with uh, that color. I forgot the word, the name of that color, but it's kind of like vintagey. Um, it's not blue, not green. Um, kind of like vintage looking color. So I paint that couple of layers, spray paint. And after when it's dry, I just put the, I picked the, um, for purpose, I picked the paper where it was air balloon. It actually was two here and there had air balloons. And I distress edges like you can see here in the heart. And um, what I did, so one air balloon, I left it on, on the paper, and our uh, air balloon, I kind of like created and made it like it's three-dimensional air, hot air balloon, so I was playing with paper a little bit, distress, I just created air balloon halfway, so it's not full around, it's only half. And then I put the trim here and the beautiful ring stones with diamonds flowers, what I really like here. And then on the corner, so my goal was to do some kind of like vintage looking wall hangers. So, and uh, you can put it on the wall or just stand it like this. You can put it stand like picture frame. And uh, here on the bottom on, in the balloon, I was using open roses from vintage sets. So it's kind of like pink. And this is, um, I call it like. Um, um, mocha color it's not brown brown it's more this is more like brown brown but this is like mocha color actually this real will be mocha but this is more um, warm uh, shade 
and uh, three different sizes and then I had uh, this is what I was talking so this is white um, hip rose buds but this is uh, from previous set I don't have that um, I, don't, I, I, I will look and put uh, in descriptions box, the link, box links to that product and then uh, six millimeter open uh, uh, hip rose buds and then this is my silver stance here and this is stick pin so I choose same color pearls what goes match with that uh, tin and uh, this is beautiful lustin crown stick pins I like that and all around uh, you can see all around I cover with two different uh, laces it's actually cream tone uh, laces one lace then teardrops pearls teardrops shape and the flower lace like tiny flowers here so this is one and here on the uh, on, on the corner I with E6000 I glue the metal to the metal uh, over tin and inside I put again um, vintage flowers bouquet here so you can see my four millimeters hip, open uh, uh, hip rose hip rose here and um, um, open roses two different um, sizes it's actually 25 and 15 millimeters and here is a uh, 10 millimeters and tiny tiny roses from that beautiful uh, set and here I just die cut and distresses the little tickets, um, tickets for like tickets right from like um to ride and um, uh, kind of like circ balloons related uh, tickets. So I put them um, kind of like clustered together and on the top I put the bird. So air balloon is fine, bird is fine. <laughs> right and few little things so oh see i forgot to glue that so sometimes i put it and i forgot so i will glue that so this is my um um wall hanger using the tin and the theme is like a uh, hot air balloon and old uh, not syrup but some fun going on right so this is my um metal tin uh, wall hanger or stand for the frame so uh, thank you everyone for watching and um, hopefully you maybe can create something using same idea metal I thought it's I, I think it's a lot of things we can play and a lot of things we can do with tins it was nice um, time for me to create that project so thank you everyone and have a good day everyone. Bye.